welcome back to my YouTube channel, it's Joy here again, and today we're going to be doing yet another wig review, and this wig review is brought to you by Shop Hair Wig, but before we get started, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, and if you're new to my channel, welcome. So today's wig is brought to you by Shop Hair Wigs, and this um, wig is from Bobby Boss, this is one of their new wigs, and this is the Milo wig, I am wearing her in the color number 2, which you kind of can't even tell, it looks more like a 1 or a 1B. Um, but it's a, like a really, really natural brownish black color. So I purposely chose this one because I've been getting more into twos. I feel like they're not like super duper dark, but they're not super light either. So it's just perfect. It's a perfect balance and it's almost the same color as my natural hair as well. So let's get into the specs on this wig. So this is from their HD Ultra Scalp Illusion Collection. And so with this wig, you are getting a 13 by 5 deep lace parting space or just a frontal space right here. It is a pre plucked hairline, free parting. Um, like I said, it says Meta, Meta Fresh Safe and Clean Cap. And um, yeah, and she does come in different colors if you guys are interested. The color that the model is wearing is actually very gorgeous, kind of like a Kind of like a white silverish color which the color that she's wearing is tt6 slash pl platinum gold i guess that's that's the name of it but um yeah that's pretty much it you guys now let's get into like cap construction and stuff like that so cap construction on this wig is definitely big head friendly i did have to adjust my straps and i still feel like there's a little bit of space in there she does have some combs if you guys don't want to glue her on like I did I decided to just go ahead and glue her on because I want her to look just a little bit more natural now with this lace I will say the lace is not like super white or anything like that but I wouldn't say it's super transparent either but it is easy to work with I did go ahead and tint my lace with this spray right here this is the even I don't, I don't know how to pronounce this, but I've seen a lot of people using this spray. It's actually my first time using it. I thought it was okay. I mean, it didn't. I, I still had to put like some powder on the lace or whatever. But I guess I'll use this on something else and see how it works. I didn't really get the most use out of it, but I did tint my lace just a little bit, and then I did put some powder, as you guys can see. Now, uh, um, I will be honest with you guys, when I did install this wig, I made the mistake of gluing the wig on while it was like parted already. So I thought that the parting space was like a side part and I put the, the part to the side. So I can, I technically, if I want to swoop the hair this way, I would have to take the wig off completely to go ahead and do that because I glued it on wrong. But, I mean, it still came out pretty cute. It's not nothing bad. I would definitely put a little bit more powder and a little bit more concealer, which I did put some of my concealer right here on the lace, on the hairline, because I feel like the hairline still looks just a tad bit ghostly, in my opinion. So, I feel like I could have done better on my part with that. Um, but I do feel like it looks a little bit ghostly. Now, when it comes to the hair, because I know a lot of people want to know the texture of this hair, how does it feel? The texture is really soft, and it is a very glossy and very shiny texture, of synth like synthetic texture. But my only, my only problem with the hair is that the hair easily, like if your hands have products on it or whatever the case is, it adheres to the hair way too easy to the point where the hair just becomes, I wouldn't say stiff, but it just like sticks onto the hair. I don't know if that makes any sense, but it kind of like, it was hard for me like to swoop the, the hair to the side and play around with it as much because it was just stuck in like one place. And even when I was trying to like part it in the middle, um, I didn't feel like getting up to get my, um, my what's that called my hot comb to do the hot comb to do a middle part so i was just like i'm not even gonna force myself to do this right now but even with that like the hair just wasn't like naturally flipping it was like i had to like put something on top of it for it to stay down so i don't know if that makes any sense or if you guys have experienced this with synthetic wigs but 
there are certain synthetic wigs that the hair is so silky that it just kind of clumps together. Like, it ends up clumping together. When it comes to tangling, I did notice that you could experience some tangling with this wig. Um, because of the curls at the end and the way that it's styled. I honestly thought that the hair was going to be a little bit more fluffier. And this is why I was surprised with the texture overall. Because I felt like the texture was too... Like, I thought it was just going to be like a nice flip. Like, a nice little flip up. And like a natural blowout type of effect. And it just ended up being more like curls. Versus it being like a flip up. Like how the model has it. This is why I kind of like, I was going to use this. I purposely got this wig because I was going to use it for a TikTok, like a 70s TikTok. But honestly, she's not giving me 70s. She's giving me more like 90s, um, debutante, you know, bougie. She's cute. She really is cute. And what I love the most about her is that you can wear her as a deep side part. You can swoop to the front like she is giving she is definitely giving i won't take it away from it like i'm not even disappointed in this wig because this wig is actually really cute and i don't know if i've ever told you guys this but i'm really a big big fan of bobs like bobs has to be my favorite style because it's not too too short you know but it's short you know like i love short haircuts i love them but bobs are my absolute favorite i feel like they frame my face perfectly i really have a very square shaped face like my jawline i don't know if you guys have noticed this but my jawline is super strong so i feel like short haircuts and bobs like really bring that out and really accentuate my face they also make my face look a lot thinner and this swoop to the side is giving sis like this is really cute honestly i feel like the wig is really cute but I feel like the texture is where it kind of failed me a little bit and um it's just crazy because like the back of the wig like on the card on the stock card it shows like more curls the way that it is in person but the front of the wig on the stock card is more like flipped out like this to me is just giving me more curls than anything but this wig is super cute i think that she is a great collection to your edition it, i mean you're a great addition to your collection if you guys are interested in milo i would definitely get my hands on her because she is definitely giving bad bougie cute debutante 90s honey um grown and sexy she's giving it she's giving all that energy so if that's who you are sis because that's definitely who i am i'm almost in my 30s grown and sexy um i'll definitely get my hands on her so um yeah shout outs to shop hair wigs and bobby boss for sending me this wig to review for you guys make sure that you guys go ahead and follow my instagram i will be putting your instagram handle below and also make sure that you do Go ahead and press the link below where you guys can go ahead and purchase this beautiful unit Milo because she is giving. Make sure you guys go ahead and purchase her because I just think she's she's cute for the summer too, by the way. So she is giving. Oh, I am so feeling my. You know what she's giving? She's giving like early 2000s um, video vixens too. Like she's giving that real old school sexy, grown and sexy vibes. Like. I'm feeling her. I think I might wear her out one day. Like, I really love this wig. So, yeah. Make sure that you guys uh, follow me on Instagram at Peralta Knows Best. And if you haven't done so, sis, go ahead and subscribe and like this video if you enjoyed it. I will see you guys soon. Bye.